Namaste. Today we are going to give you some information about Darwin, Essington School and what sort of the quality education they are pursuing there. To give all about this information, we have special guest from the Essington School. She pursue her education in the US and working in Australia. First of all, I would like to welcome Jaya Srinivas. Jaya ma'am, you are welcome on our show. Thank you so much, Sunilji. Namaste. Okay. Namaste to you and to all your uh, viewers. Okay, especially talking about your Nepal visit, I think it's your second visit. Yeah? This is my second visit and I just absolutely have fallen in love with this country. Um, I've uh, left India about 27 years ago. I'm now living in Australia. I'm an Australian citizen and I travel the world and uh, Nepal has to be one of my most favorite destinations now. Okay, especially talking about the Essington School, would you please give some information about this institution? The Essington International School Darwin goes right across from preschool to year 12. Uh, we've got 1300 students right across. Being an international school, we attract students and families from around the world. The senior college, which is the year 10, 11, 12 program, is based at the Charles Darwin University campus. And uh, we've got about 250 students there. On my last trip, um, I was very fortunate to work again with KBA Global. We've got a very strong partnership with KBA Global, um, with Shambhu Kadel and Roshan Chetri, who is also here from Darwin, Australia. And um, we have been successful in bringing three students across uh, from my last trip, um, Amit, uh, Smriti, and uh, Roshi. And they're all A plus A students. So I'm very, very happy that the Nepali students, when they come to Australia, continue to study, work hard, and good, get very good results. OK, especially today, Cordell Brother um, uh, Association Global um, uh, conduct the seminar. And it's a breaking news for a student. Previously, a student just um, uh, they passed the plus two. Mm. Then after they um, uh, get the test preparation and um, uh, make a pathway for the Australia. But uh, here, students are really happy. They got the option. Would you please give some information about this? The progression pathway that has been the purpose of this visit for me to explain to the students. I've had about 20 students meet with me this morning, and we've got few <coughs> more students coming in. Um, the progression pathway. We provide them with an absolutely immense opportunity to come and study the year 11-12 program at the Essington International Senior College. Um, what I'm recommending is that the students come six months advance. They come to do semester two, that is from July 2018. They join the Essington International Senior College. They then finish the year 10 and then go on to finish the year 11 and 12 program and they'll finish it in 2020. So the progression pathway is very clear. The very honest, sincere students who want to have a very bright future in Australia. Um, as a reputed international senior college, we are happy to welcome the Nepali students <coughs> into Darwin and to provide them with high quality education. The Australian education system is being quite popular among the students and parents as well. In this case, uh, would you please give some information about the uh, education system of uh, Australia as well as the Charles Darwin University and Essington A School? The Essington International Senior College um, program uh, is individually uh, catered for and tailored for each individual student. So students get one-on-one -on -one support. So when students come to our college, we ensure that they're tracking well. I take a personal interest as the executive assistant principal in ensuring that the international students coming to us are tracking well. If there are areas that they need support in, in academics or in English or whatever be the subject, ensure that they get the additional support so they can continue to get good marks and good grades. We want them to come to us and get extremely good results, which will be a foundation for them to then apply for university courses, tertiary courses. I have a personal interest to see them completing their year 11-12 program at our senior college, but continuing to study at the Charles Darwin University and hopefully remain 
in Darwin, if not in the Northern Territory. So I've got an agenda definitely to see them coming to my senior college, but I also would like to see the Nepali community is one of the fastest growing community in Northern Territory. So the statistics will show you that the Nepali community is growing rapidly. And I'm hoping these students will continue to come to us and will continue to grow the population in Northern Territory. Talking about the international student community, mm -hmm. what sort of the support um, Sintan School is providing to them? As I said, um, we have a system where they get individual support. So uh, the three, uh, we've got three students at the moment, but there are other international students as well. We've got other Nepali students as well. They get individual support. Um, Study NT is another organization which continues to provide a variety of different activities and support systems for international students. The NT government, our uh, territory government is very much invested in ensuring that this market grows, this student, international student market continues to grow in the Northern Territory. Um, statistics again will indicate to you that when it comes to international students, the Nepali international students are the highest in the numbers in the Northern Territory. So obviously, Darwin and Northern Territory continues to be a favorite destination uh, for Nepali students. And I would like to uh, continue to see those numbers only increase in the coming years. Okay, especially uh, today's seminar is quite successful, I think. And uh, talking about the, your experience with Conrad Brother, Associate Global, what is your experience? My experience is very good. Shambhu Kadel, um, I call him my brother, and um, uh, he, he and I work extremely well together. Uh, we are in regular contact with one another. Um, he is a, a very well regarded um, member in Nepal. Uh, his name is very well known. I've been to Chitwan, I've been to Bharatpur, and uh, he's highly regarded in your community. Now, when you take Shambhu Kadel in the Darwin community, he's highly regarded in the Darwin community as well. And I feel very privileged and honored to be working very closely with him and his team in the KBA Global. I'd like to personally thank Roshan Chetri as well. He's currently here from Darwin, Northern Territory, and uh, has great vision for the international students' uh, numbers from Nepal coming into Darwin. And uh, I commend him for that, and I thank him sincerely for all the help he has provided me on this current uh, trip as well. Uh, tomorrow, I'm, uh, there's uh, no weekend for me when I come to Nepal. I'm working this weekend and I'll be meeting a lot of parents uh, tomorrow and the day after. And day after, I, of course, I fly back to uh, Darwin Northern Territory. Um, Darwin weather is very, very similar to what you experience here in Kathmandu. We don't get so cold in winter, but the heat doesn't seem to be a big problem because you're used to the humidity and uh, the heat as well. Um, so that's uh, interesting to see. And also the distance, the proximity, from Kathmandu to Singapore is a four hour flight. And then again from Singapore to Darwin is another four hour flight. So when you're looking at it, it's only about eight hours. And parents enjoy coming to Darwin. We've had Nepali parents visiting their children in uh, Darwin and we provide them where possible accommodation and assistance uh, um, with um, staying arrangements when they come to visit their children. So um, it's been an extremely productive partnership with uh, KBA Global, and um, I, I will continue to work very closely with uh, Shambhu Kadel, Roshan Chetri, and the rest of the team in the years to come. Okay, what is your message to the prospective student and parents who are really interested to uh, pursue their education through the Australian education system regarding Darwin and regarding the Essington School. The Essington International Senior College speaks for itself. Um, we have extremely good results. Um, and for me, it is an immense opportunity for students coming from Nepal, from Kathmandu, Bharatpur, Chitwan district, wherever they want to come from. Uh, it seems to be a very, very good partnership. Uh, they seem to ease into the education system because, as I said, we provide them with individual support to ensure 
that each and every one of them succeeds in the pathway, in the subjects they have chosen. Um, they also get an, uh, uh, an excellent overview of what Australian life is all about. Sunil, I was born in India. Um, I studied in the US, I studied in Australia, I now work uh, in Australia. That is in my generation. Today's mm -hmm. student really is an international student. Every one of them is. Whether they are born in Nepal, India, Sri Lanka, it doesn't matter. We do not know tomorrow where they are going to do their tertiary and where then they are going to go to work. Australia is a very popular destination, a very easy um, environment for the children of this age group to settle into. Darwin has a massive Nepali community. We just had uh, the Nepali New Year celebration um, in Darwin and it was a very successful event. And we are going to continue to see the Nepali community grow. There are already four Nepali restaurants in, uh, in Darwin. So when you come uh, in June, we look forward to welcoming you, uh, Sunil, and your team to the Essington International Senior College. And I hope to take you around Darwin and we'll certainly take you to one of the Nepali restaurants if you would like to uh, taste uh, the Nepali cuisine in Darwin. Um, Darwin, you have Nepali um, spices and foods are easily available um, and all the festivals are, uh, you know, celebrated there. It's a very rich multicultural community, so children from Nepal will learn about other cultures, whether the Greek culture or the Italian festival or the Thai festival or the Indian festival. They'll have an immense opportunity to experience the rich multicultural life. So to all those students, to all those families and parents looking for an opportunity to send their children overseas, I strongly recommend Darwin and I strongly recommend the Essington International Senior College. Okay, thank you so much. You have provided most of the important thing of uh, destination, school and uh, international student community and so on things. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Sunil.